Hey guys, day 10 of the 30 day yoga challenge. I'm feeling fabulous because it's day 10 of the 30 day yoga challenge. And yesterday and today I've been writing about trauma, one of the big T's of trauma, and in particular natural disasters. And just informing people on a hypnosis meditation app, the Aura app, if they are going through a natural disaster, that that kind of falls into one of the big T's of trauma. You see, because your body uh, responds in a very specific way, in a special way, in regards to trauma. You might have noticed if you've gone through a traumatic experience, your body's natural ability to cope a little bit differently. And Marlene Rios and Joyce Friedman have kindly pointed out that trauma can leave an impression not just in our minds, but in our body, especially in our muscles. Because if you were to take a moment to think about your blood and your arteries and your veins and how it's much like water running through irrigation canals, you know that if there's mud, uh, that, that water will stop flowing as freely. And when those channels get blocked, it's when the water is needed most. Just like the tiny muscles in your veins or arteries can tighten up after trauma. You might notice things like cold hands, stiff shoulders, almost as if your body is on high alert. Maybe like a tiny kangaroo or tiger ready to pounce. But here's the kicker, you already know how to communicate with your body in so many different ways. You probably understand the benefits of deep breathing from your diaphragm, or maybe you've had a therapist suggest for you to try progressive muscle relaxation. Or you might just visualize your muscles loosening up with a body scan, or just imagining the sunlight on the palms of your hands can make your blood flow, flow a little freer. But you'll find the right method that works for you. I really kind of just want to point out even a gentle bit of stretching could be what your body is craving right now. So when you arrive at yoga practice, I'm not a qualified yoga instructor, so maybe I shouldn't say this, but you don't need to try that hard. Just a little bit of stretching, do what feels right. Just do whatever feels comfortable for you because you're perfect just as you are. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that. I'm feeling fabulous and I hope you got a bit of a giggle or feel inspired to just relax and try a bit of yoga today. Take care.